Yeah. Um, all right, put them on. Hey, uh, I don't know, probably another hour, why? Listen, it's not my problem, okay? Yeah, that's right, it's not my problem, it's their problem, because I'll tell you what, I'm not going to the set anymore. No, I'm gonna sit right here in my office, I'm busy, I'm watching a cut. We want a Peabody, do you understand? A Peabody, that's right. Do you know, they give those things to bishops and popes. At Sickening that the world is giving them all these laurels and bestowing them with these things, and now they think they're you know, half decent writers and producers. No, Peabody's, that's sort of like uh, uh, Blackwell's list of, of quality writing. Isn't that what the Peabody's are? Now we've won a Peabody. Like, the world's going to watch our show expecting cutting edge, sort of, um, you know, political, social dramas with human stories, and we're making, like, I don't know. That's right, a Peabody. And I'm not going to the set, and I'm not going to any read throughs, and I'm not going any place except right here where I'm going to sit and watch my cut. Well, expectations are high now, you know, like higher than they've ever been. I think you could say across across the world um, and between you and me I think I've started to see signs that that uh, the pressure is getting to them I hope they can hold it together for at least one more season because uh, I'm hoping to buy a house soon so I'm watching a cut that's what I do I look at cuts I tell them what's good I tell them what's bad and I move on do you realize who you're talking to David's already got an ego. I don't. I don't possibly understand how it could have made, made it bigger. No, we're just like little minions now that he's won a Peabody. Uh, David got everything under control. No, all gone through his head. Yeah, a while ago. To be honest with you, I'm really worried because everyone's acting like um, they're folding under the pressure. I don't know. I heard some rumor about David flying in on a helicopter now. He's been carrying the Peabody with him. Did you see that? We have a helipad. I'm sure that that's pretty much um, how he's getting to work these days. You know, it's fine. They, they certainly have been showing up to set in helicopters a lot more often, which, uh, which I suppose you could say it's good for morale. I'm not really sure if that kind of showboating is appreciated by the crew, but... All right. Now, now it's fine. Don't... Yeah. All right. Tell, tell Mrs. Zucker hello. Okay. Um, okay, I have to be funny now. I have to no, roast David Icke. I don't, I don't get to hang out with David Icke enough to roast him. I mean, I rub his belly. 